What's up, YouTube? It's almost 12 o'clock at night. I have a horrible, horrible cough. And this will be the very first video I'm going to be uploading on my channel. Um, so, my name is Benjamin Castillo. I am currently 32 years old. I live in Modesto, California, but I'm originally from Mexico City. Uh, let's see. I was born in April, so I'm Aries. Um, my first language, of course, is Spanish, and I learned English when I came to the U.S., and the reason why I'm doing this is, or these videos, it's because I'm an amputee. What is an amputee? It's a person who has lost a limb. That could be a leg or a um, arm. Could be one, could be two. But me, I lost my left leg above the knee. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, so the reason why I'm doing this kind of videos, it's because I want people to be a little bit more conscious about what a life, uh, what is, how's the life of an amputee, you know? Um, there are certain things that are kind of difficult now. I danced since I was six years old. I was in a folklore, uh, Mexican folklore, uh, ballet. And uh, since I was six years old, I've been dancing my whole life. Um, what else? So my life changed after I lost my leg. On December 16, 2014, I had an accident at work. And because it was not treated right, uh, the next day I had to have an amputation. Um, my life has, ch has changed. Um, things are difficult sometimes. But I found different ways to make my life enjoyable. I, um, it's funny. Um, the first day after I woke up from um, the surgery, I mean, I will tell you a little bit more about how it happened and all, all the details, you know. But, um, uh, right now, I want to focus on a couple of things, you know, the main important things and why this channel is so important to me. Um, right after my surgery, or when I came out of the uh, anesthesia, um, a friend of mine, his name is John, he also used to be my former employer, my first boss, actually. In California he was there by my side on uh, in the ICU he was taking care of me I guess he saw me awake and kind of in disbelief I don't remember if I was crying or not but I still remember every single word that he said to me that night he said, Benjamin, you have been given the opportunity to be free. You're going to experience a freedom that in no other way you would have been able to experience. And at that moment, I didn't know what he, what he meant. But now I know. <clears throat> 
it's incredible, incredible, the things that had happened to me ever since. Um, all my doctors have said that my recovery was kind of amazing. Um, because I worked really hard, really, really hard to be where I am right now. And I still have with me those words that I was going to be free in a way that I've never experienced before. And I'll be, I'll be back to that in a moment. Also, my mother, told, my parents, they live in Mexico. Uh, they are not here with me. But you will get to know my life a little bit. You know, I'll be introducing people to you guys. I'll be telling you guys who they are and what they mean to me. But so my parents from Mexico, they couldn't be here when uh, the accident happened. So um, uh, one of my really good friends, really, really good friends, uh, but more than friends, they are my family too. So I will call her my sister, Tanya. She made every single possible call and text and everything on her way to communicate with my family and tell them what was going on. So when I woke up, I saw my family. And of course, I didn't t uh, took I didn't take it really well. And remember my mom saying, "Son, you're more than just a leg." So during my recovery process, I was able to get words of encouragement and wisdom that I still carry with me until this day because they keep reminding me that I am strong and that I can overcome anything and that I can work through anything. So these videos, this channel, it's going to be about me just being me, lazy, funny, sad, in pain, exercising sometimes, uh, maybe eating. It's, it's different. It's kind of different when you're an amputee. I'm not saying that I need to be treated differently. I'm just saying that I needed I needed to adapt to so many things. And uh, it's amazing. I want to share that with every single one because my my um what do you call it when um when you have a phrase that is your your um my mantra, I think that's what it's called, is if I can do it, then you can do it. And I am grateful for all the, the examples that I received through all these years. It's been three years since my accident, since I lost my leg. And um, I'm grateful for all those examples and blessings and everything that made me the person I am today why I decided to do it today I've been thinking about it for a long time it's just I was afraid poor baby poor Jarvis I was afraid of People, reactions, questions, comments. What's up, baby?
And um, not anymore. I'm ready to face any questions. I'm ready to face any comments. I'm ready to fa face any criticisms. Because I learned to survive the worst. So I'm ready for this. I hope that my videos at some point can help someone um, become a better person or learn something about someone with uh, disabilities. I hope that through my videos and my daily routines or my or the things that I do, that I discover every day, that I learn every day, people can learn to uh, enjoy life and to know that sometimes you have second chances, sometimes you don't. I had a blessing that I have a second chance. Heavenly Father gave me a second chance on to leave and to, to enjoy this life. Not a lot of people have that. So I'm going to stop being scared and I'm going to stop caring about what other people might think. And I'm just going to do whatever I need to do in order for me to be happy. So, and with no further ado, hello, my name is Benjamin Castillo. I'm the amputee guy, <laughs> but no. I don't want people to know me for that. Sorry about my sorry about my hair. Um, I want to be the guy. Oh, there we go. I want to be the guy um, that makes cakes. I want to be the funny guy. I want to be the chubby guy. Whatever you want to call me, I just want to make sure that everyone gets to know a little bit of me and a little bit of my life. And um, you're, whoever wants to go in this ride with me, it's more than welcome. I don't know where this is gonna take, a, take us, not just me, take us. But it will be wonderful to make friends I want to connect with people. I want to uh, learn about uh, different people and their stories and their lives and their experiences and the wisdom that they uh, obtain through hard tribulations and trials and experiences, you know? And what a what a wonderful idea to have a channel where I can connect with all that. So, thank you for watching. And uh, I'm gonna be doing this. I don't know. I don't know. I honestly don't know how, how I'm gonna be doing this. Um, this is my first video and I have no idea how this works. But I'm gonna find out. You know, if I never do it, I'm, well, if I never do it, I was never going to do it. So that's why I decided to do it right now. I have a cake in the oven. I have to check it out. So I have to go for now. But um, thank you for listening. These late, it's 12 o'clock at uh 12 o'clock at night and uh, it's late and I just had you know a couple of things on my mind so if you have any suggestions for me if you have any tips or things that I can do to make my channel more interesting more fun let me know and we'll be talking soon have a good night bye